for me it's not about writing books <laughs> it's about living the story that God's given you to live and the stories come out of your life and your living not like oh that you can tell this isn't what I thought oh this would be a really good book to write what I did was I just I lived directly out of 1000 gifts and this just sort of organically unfolded from that and then I wrote about the stories that happened out of the living so it wasn't an intentional here this is a good idea to market a book it was this is what I'm living and wrestling out of after what does it mean to live a grateful life and after I had contemplated all of these gifts counted all of the ways God had loved me and relentlessly pursued me what do you do with all of those gifts what does Jesus do at the Lord's Supper he breaks the bread and he gives it what does it look like to live broken and given into a broken-hearted world my heart had sort of broken with gratefulness <laughs> at the end of 1000 gifts and I'd heard people all the people that I'd met who'd read 1000 gifts who'd written out their own and gratitude list they were giving thanks for hard things in broken places so what is the answer to pain and suffering in the world what do you do how do you live with your one broken heart and what does it mean to live an abundant life so those are sort of the things that I just naturally began to wrestle out of the process of writing 1000 gifts so the broken way really is the other half of the heart of 1000 gifts yesterday I was in a bookstore signing books and it was just it struck me oh my goodness all of these people are carrying my heart around in their hands. <laughs> it, writing The Broken Way really was that kind of level of vulnerability. Um, but I hope it gives the gift of telling people they're not alone in their brokenness. It's not just um, everybody else has it together and I'm the only one that doesn't have it together. But I think we give each other the gift of saying I'm broken and that allows other people to come with their own brokenness and to encounter Christ, a kind of communion in a really um, we want to be connected to people and we can only be connected to people when we share our brokenness.